hey you guys welcome or welcome back to my channel and to another vlog so in this vlog i'm going to be sharing a work trip that i went to sorry y'all i know it was a bit ago but it's just taken me so long to edit because work has been working work has been busy um remember i told you guys i don't have a set busy season we have busier periods it's been a lot of presenting to audit committees so getting that prepared wrapping up audits and then it's getting towards the end of the year so prepping for next year's audit plan we have risk assessments a lot going on but i did want to share with you guys um this vlog because a lot of y'all think that traveling as an accountant or as a consultant is always glamorous it's fun but you guys it's not always what it's made out to be and i try to share my honest thoughts and opinions for you guys before we get started i just wanted to say thank you to ana luisa for partnering with me on this video i did get a few new pieces from ana luisa because they are having their anniversary sale it does end on october 19th so make sure you guys go grab yourself something before the sale is over but ana luisa's website overall always has some great pieces and you can shop my pieces on the like to know it app ltk i will have the link below you guys can follow me on there anytime i post my ana luisa jewelry you guys will be the first to know and I will share with you guys some of the pieces that I am currently wearing right now. I love their bracelets, the earrings, the whole works. I have had my Ana Luisa pieces since I started working with them back in 2021. And you guys, they're still going strong. I have gifted several of my Ana Luisa pieces as well to friends and family so highly recommend shopping the sale and since ana luisa did turn five they are offering you up to 30 percent off on your order i will have the code on the screen for you guys make sure you go and shop ana luisa Welcome back to a new vlog so I am in Boston I literally just got to my hotel room like 10 minutes ago and just quickly freshened up and about to head into the office I will share a room tour later because I have a new room this is a different room than where I usually stay so I'll definitely share that with you guys but let me show y'all my outfit and then I have to head into the office to meet with my senior manager because we have a client call this afternoon that got to prepare for it and then just have to catch up on emails since I was on the plane for like three hours. I've been up since 5 a.m. My flight left Houston at 7 and then we got here like 12.35. So it's 1.43. Um, it took forever to get an Uber from Boston Logan to the area that I'm staying at. So let me show y'all my outfit and then I gotta go. Um, I hope y'all can see but this is the outfit i just have on my zara blazer and then this shirt from shein my zara trousers and then these um these loafers from h&m if y'all remember one of my last videos um i had mentioned that i don't always want to wear heels and sometimes we're doing lots of walking but i still wanted a shoe that elevates me and my other loafers that i have are just too low um, and I need something with a little bit more support and so I got these chunky ones at H&M recently I do have two of them I have this with the gold and then I have another one that's just all black which I'll show you guys whenever I go back home hey you guys so I'm back from the office getting ready to go to dinner we're going to this Italian place it's like a very like it's a small restaurant like very intimate mom and pop place is called copa and y'all i just want to be comfortable i had another outfit planned but i'm just going with the, my amazon two-piece set which i'll show y'all and i think i'm gonna wear my crocs um i was gonna wear sneakers i have sneakers but my feet swelled up on the plane 
and so I don't want to be like uncomfortable with sneakers they were my feet were already hurting with the loafers on and those loafers are pretty comfortable so I'm gonna have to wear Crocs and hope no one looks at my feet the lighting in this vlog is gonna be horrible and I apologize I think I'm just gonna cave and buy a new camera so I'm just gonna put this on in case I get cold I can button it up in case I get cold um, but y'all I'm so exhausted from traveling like travel days are not glamorous like people make it seem as I told you guys I was up at 5 a.m. I was up at 5 a.m. to like make sure I got ready my husband dropped me off at the airport around like 6 15 um, that's one of the perks of living close to the airport <laughs> And that's one of the reasons that when we bought our house, we made sure it was within a reasonable distance from the airport because of all the travel that we do for work, like both myself and my husband. And I love the other side of Houston. I love Katie and all that, but I'm not about to be driving super early when I have like 6 a.m. or 7 a.m. or 8 a.m. flights, especially with Houston traffic. So I love that we live close enough to the airport. Um... But yeah, I was up, was on this like almost four hour flight. The person in front of me just has no etiquette, no manners. The lady next to me had her cat and like her cat hair was everywhere. Y'all, it was a whole conundrum, but thank the Lord we made it. But I'm just like crashing and it's hard when you go on these work trips and then you have to like do team activities. And y'all like, I just want to go to sleep. I want to order my food and eat it here in the room and then fall asleep i don't have any more team bonding energy left in me but we're gonna do it because me and my team we get along really well or my team and i like our team is a pretty good team we get along pretty well so um it's all good i didn't bring the push up matisse because i always bring it so i'm just taking my dionysus uh chain wallet bag it's just it matches the outfit and then i could just have it on cross bodied traveling is nice and all but it is not as glamorous as y'all think like i miss my house i miss my bed i miss my kitchen i miss eating my own food and i'm just so tired from being up since 7 a.m and it's like it's six o'clock right now um and we're about to head out for dinner by the time we're done dinner it's gonna probably be like eight eight almost nine and then in case they want to go out for drinks i'm hoping not usually in these situations i don't drink alcohol so i usually just go for a mocktail and even wine like i've been weaning off like wine and stuff but y'all know i love me a good glass of wine but when we go to like speakeasies here in boston and stuff or like going out like i just have mocktails i never ask for alcohol that might be tomorrow because everybody from our team will be here tomorrow but hopefully tonight we could just go to dinner and then like go home because then tomorrow I have an early day getting ready for going to the client site. Gonna be on the client site all day. It's not as glamorous as everybody always makes it seem. Hopefully you guys can see, but it's just a casual like outfit and then with the Crocs. I don't know why we gotta walk everywhere. I don't walk. I live in the suburbs. I live in Texas. I don't have sidewalks. Uh, this outside of my immediate neighborhood, there's no sidewalks. You drive everywhere, and these folks love to walk. <laughs> so trying to be comfortable, for sure. And even like for my outfit tomorrow for dinner, I'm wearing a dress probably, and I'm gonna have my sneakers on. Hopefully by then my feet are not swollen. Again with another chatty vlog. <laughs> because i can't vlog for you guys when i'm at the office because we're actually working and i obviously can't like do b-roll when i'm at the client site obviously right and at the office like we all work in one room so it's hard for me to do that i usually when i'm usually at the office by myself it's easier for me to do b-roll and have it more of a, like a relaxing y'all watch me work vlog these kind of vlogs when i'm traveling i have to narrate and give you guys like the detail as to what's happening so hopefully you guys don't find it too chatty
Take it away, take it away, feeling too good to me Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough Too caught up in your love I've been trying to forget But you won't let me Something in my brain wants you I've been hanging by myself Asking for help But nothing seems to work on you Yeah, I just finished getting ready. My coworkers are about to come pick me up soon. And then we're just gonna go straight to the client site. Gonna be at the client site all day. Pray for your girl. I don't think it's gonna take as long as the client is anticipating because the last time we did this audit for a different department, it literally took us only like four hours where we thought it was going to take us a whole day so praying that that's the same thing six locations and i think three or four of the six are within the same campus area so that should be good it's just like walking for us which is why i brought the loafers and not heels if it was a situation that we would just be going to somebody's office and doing walkthroughs indoors then i would definitely wear heels but y'all we're gonna be walking outside so yeah some of these people I've never met before and obviously it's a client you want to put on your good impression. I did a little bit more than I usually do. That is pretty much it. Like my whole day is going to be client and then afterwards we are going to a team dinner. I'm about to go check some emails and just make sure I have everything ready for going on site with a client and I will talk to you guys. I'll probably share with you guys clips from dinner. If not, I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> I made it home a little bit ago um, and then had to send out a few emails and just wrap up work but so glad to be back home y'all I used to love traveling when I was in my early 20s or when I started off my career but now it's not as fun anymore I love the perks and I love being with my team but it's just the fact that like I'm not home and I miss my husband I miss my nephew I just miss my house but good thing we only travel for three days now out of the week instead of like four days out the week which is really good and i have another trip next week and the trip of the week after that and then i'm done with trips for i think the rest of the year um no and then i have to go to l i think i go to california in october or november something like that but y'all it's glam but 
I feel like when you're not like when you're married or if, or as you get older, it's just not as glam anymore. I want to be home, okay? But uh, let me show you guys some PR that I did get. I was gonna make this all aesthetic, this portion, but y'all would just. I just don't feel like it. I'm tired. <laughs> but I did get the um, replica Maison. What is it? Maison Margiela replica um, beach walk scent. The fragrance description is sun kissed, salty skin. So here it is. And it does smell really good. I really like this smell. It was, it was gifted. It was gifted to me um, as a part of PR. And then I just recently got on Lancome's PR, which I'm super grateful for. So let me show you guys what they sent me. I just saw this today. My husband had called me like two, day like two days ago when I was on my trip when it came. So I was super excited. And he already smelled the fragrances. Um, but it's these fragrances right here. The packaging is gorgeous as well, but it's these ones here. It's the classic Eau de Parfum. Um, and then it's like this one here. It's clean. It's like a clean scent and it has rose, jasmine, citrus, and white musk. So you want to smell like very clean, very chill. This one, I'll probably be using this one like when I'm home. Um, my husband really loves this one. He said this is his favorite. It's luminous and it has rose concentrate, white orchid, and vanilla, which I love. It smells amazing. Um, I can pair this with my Gentle Fluidity by Maison Francis. Um, and then this one here, it's like sunny. And this one has Centifolia, rich jasmine, bergamot, and salted vanilla. And I really like the smell of this one too. I'll say one, two, three in that order of my favorite. Um, and then I got makeup as well from Lancome and this is the box from um, Lancome by Sheka she's a makeup artist and so it just came with a bunch of different stuff here there is um, waterproof eyeline waterproof eyeliner I got a like a mascara base and enhancer so I'll put this on and then my mascara maybe next time next week on my work trip I'll take some of these so I can show you guys like my makeup using these products um, left lash lifting volumizing mascara this is a perfume this is eau de parf this is like a spray on perfume Loomis luminous and it smells really good so I could take it on a work trip instead of taking one of my bottles I got the full size of the youth activating concentrate I got a priming serum some SPF yes black people need sunscreen too please put on your sunscreen especially if you live in Texas it is hot over here okay y'all need sunscreen um, I got this really pretty eyeshadow palette. Let me show you all. I think it's really pretty. And again, like very compact, easy to take with me with my bag, like in my purse for a work trip. Instead of having to like take a full eyeshadow palette, I could just easily pop this in my bag. And then I got two lip glosses. It's like the Y'all remember the lip glosses from like back in the day? It's kind of in the similar tube. Um, hope y'all can see. That's everything that I got. Um, and yeah, so I think that's gonna be it for this work trip vlog. Again, it was more of a chatty vlog than um, what I was expecting it to be. But y'all, I just, when I'm traveling, it's so hard to get B-roll and just get footage of me doing stuff because I can't have my phone out when I'm on client site, obviously. And I'm not gonna have a camera and a tripod and a tripod showing that that's not professional. So try to show you guys what I can and like talk y'all through it. I prefer 
vlogs where people do talk and explain than just b-roll if y'all like it then y'all stick around so all right y'all i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog and really seeing how like my travel days do go and getting my inner thoughts again i couldn't share much of the working part the b-roll but y'all know how it goes i am going to be having some more vlogs coming for you some work vlogs uh, some work from home vlogs those are coming back soon and i do have some home updates to share there's a couple of things that we have done to the home thus far just as we continue to transform it into our comfy cozy house um for those of y'all who don't know i did get a builder grade home and we are slowly transforming it have some super fun projects um, i'm super excited to share with you guys my fall decor i have been sharing it on shorts so make sure you guys are checking out the shorts but in the next vlogs we're gonna get back into the work from home life i'm gonna be doing some of my cleaning routine there's gonna be a fall cleaning video coming out a lot of great stuff so make sure you guys subscribe and turn on your notifications and please make sure you guys go and shop Ana Luisa I am gonna have the link below for you guys if you're interested uh, I highly recommend this bracelet right here this is I think by far my favorite and then if you're looking for like some nice simple jewelry go ahead and get these bracelets as well but I'm gonna have the links in the description box for you guys to shop and remember you get to save up to 30% off and I will have my like to know it shop as well where you guys can easily shop all of my Ana Luisa jewelry moving forward. I love you guys. God bless you and I will see you guys in the next vlog.